Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make a glitchy transition effect using a free plugin called Displacer Pro, check this video's description to download it. Once you have installed it, scroll to the end of our first clip and then go 20 frames backward, hold shift and press page up 2 times, then duplicate the clip and cut the beginning, cause we need just 20 frames of this duplicated layer. Now let's grab a roto brush tool and double click on duplicated layer. Let's rotoscope the car as smooth as possible. Once you are done, click on freeze button. As the freezing is done, we can close rotoscoping window and go back to our main composition. So now we should do the same with our second clip, but this time go 20 frames forward, hold shift and press page down two times, then duplicate your video and cut it right there. Scroll to very beginning of that layer and then grab a roto brush tool and double click on it. Here as well rotoscope the car as smooth as possible. Once you are done, click on freeze button. As the freezing is done, close rotoscoping window and go back to your main composition. So now make sure to select both rotoscoped layers and pre-compose them into one layer. Make sure move all attributes and adjust composition duration is selected and then rename it to whatever you want and hit OK. Create new adjustment layer now. Then cut it and match its length to a pre-composed layer. Let's apply Displacer Pro plugin on an adjustment layer. Scroll to the very beginning of an adjustment layer and then click on Translate Y stopwatch icon. Now scroll to the middle of that layer and change Translate Y to 5%. Scroll to the very end of an adjustment layer and change Translate Y back to 0%. Let's quickly check the effect. It's almost done, but Displacer is affected on a whole video and not only a cars. So to fix it, make sure to click on toggle switches slash modes and change adjustment layers mat to a pre-composed layer. And as you see the glitch is now affected only on a car and it looks really cool. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.